Hey everybody, it's Ian. Um, wanted to share with you this uh, mini album kind of guest book thing that I did for a friend of mine. Um, her baby shower is coming up and she's having a little girl as you can tell. And so um, I did this mini album for her. And um, I cut this out with my cameo, the, the album right here, and it's kind of big. And um, I was thinking I was going to put a lot of stuff in the middle. And so I left um, some room, w like in between the pages. So, it, but it's so it's kind of loose, like it's kind of floppy. I don't know how I'm gonna fix that. I don't wanna, I don't wanna, um, like glue it and make it a little bit tighter and just mess up that lace, that pretty lace in the middle right there. And so, as you can see, I use um, lace binding technique, and uh, I love this way of binding is the easiest way for me and it's just with my style it's just the most you know easy and elegant looking and this it's just so easy anyway so I'm gonna go ahead and start on the outside I um, cut these out with my cameos and um, I had bought um, some stamps recently and it was the music note one and then also the script one this one's from the Tim Holtz and this one is like stamp stampedious or stampendous or something like that um, and I used it on this little onesie here. And this one, I inked it before I sprayed it, which was a bad mistake because it kind of ran on me. But it's okay, at least it kind of, you know, did all of them instead of just like a little part of it. <laughs> so I guess that looks okay after all. Um, and then I did some little sweetheart blossoms here on the eyes. Because this one, the eye doesn't really show. Um, it's connected. So it didn't really show. So I had to make it show somehow. And so I put some flowers on there. Um, my camera's not focusing. Um, ink the edges and then put some stickles in the middle. Used one of my doilies here. This was um, given to me by my friend Van. And I finally have something to use um, it with because it was huge. It was like a huge lily, like eyelet piece that she sent me so finally got something to use it for I've been like saving it forever and um, and then this right here was a piece that came off of a wedding dress and this was just how it was um, I only got a little piece of it which I'm super sad because I love 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 this um, this was just like leftover from that dress that was used and this was all that was giving me, um, so I decided to use it on this, and I just love how it looks. I did a little flower cluster here. I'm not going to go into details on that. Most of them are my flowers, like, you know. I always try to use my flowers if I could. I put some bling on there because that looked kind of empty. And this was a little flower that I got from Michael's from the clearance sale. And then I did some um, pearls here. And then this is the inside. I did some masking right here. Um, I sprayed just some um, Lindy Stamp Gang on there and I left that there for the mom to put the baby's picture. I didn't want to cover up my little flower. And over here was the negative side of it. Well, actually this is the negative side. <laughs> and then this is the... When I left it here, there was ink all over the... the um, what is it? The stencil? And so I just flipped it over and then inked this back here so that was kind of fun cut this out um, love at first sight and it's not supposed to be for mom and dad it's supposed to be the baby's picture that's right here so and then I put two of my butterflies on there this was an envelope that I got um, from that micro sale for 99 cents and it's already made so I just glued it on there and I left the inside so that they can put pictures or whatever they want to on there and it just, just feels like that. And I left a little pocket here too. Um, I'll let them. I'll have to let them know that there's a pocket up here so they can stick sting, things in there. Um, I was thinking like you know, the little hospital pieces, papers, and you know the bands and stuff like that can go in here for the baby. So that's why I left it right there. And then in here are just um, some notes and some. This was also a card from um, that Michael sale that I got. Sorry, I'm not, I'm off camera here. But I just kind of stuck that there and I knew when I saw this piece that I would be using it for this purpose, you know, in my mini album. So I just kind of left it like that. 
I, I left this um, album kind of uninked. I usually ink like all my edges and stuff like that, but this one I just kind of left it raw. So, And these are some papers from um, Daisy Collins' um, Life of Bloom paper collections. And the mom likes purple, and so I just put some, mix a little bit of purple here and there and there. So, um, yeah. And then there's another pocket over here. Sorry, I'm just sitting here playing with it. And this is also from Daisy's paper, um, Life of Bloom paper collection. And I cut out some smaller onesies here. I put some um, of the trims here. I think this is kind of the same trim from the front of the dress, is it? I don't know, let me double check. No, it's not, but it looks like it, huh? Anyways, and then here's another heart um, cutout onesie. And then these right here, I used, um, wow, it looks better on camera, actually. I used Robin Buff. This was actually a failed that I made work. Um, the, my cameo didn't cut all the way through this thick chipboard. It did some of it, like this one it cut, but this one it didn't. So I need to figure out what the settings and stuff like that that works with my cameo for this kind of um, chipboard. But this one didn't work, and I didn't want to throw it away, so I just kind of cut around it. And then, um, like, this one's a little bit apart, but it's okay. And then I rubbed um, Rub and Buff over it. So that's what that one is. And then this one is a little stencil that I did. Um, I just sprayed some ink to tone down the colors because this paper was uh, Valentine's paper, and it was really bright. So I just sprayed some browns and toned it down. And this is just a little note card um, from the same Daisy Collins um, Life of Bloom paper line that I put in here. Just to show, you know, mom that she could put pictures right there. Because mom's not a scrapbooker, so. And then this page is another bright page. But this page is meant for the baby shower, of course, as you can see. And I wanted people to sign here. Um, and maybe perhaps, like, over here. You know, for the mom and dad. And so that's what I've left this page at. And this is a stencil that I cut out from my quick, uh, my cameo as well, and I sprayed it with um, light glimmer mist. So, and this right here, um, you can tuck this little envelope. This is the envelope from the same um, paper collection. So I used two two paper collections in this in this album, and this was from um, a leftover from my baby's um, birthday. And so I stuck it on here. And then I cut these out um, as well. And I didn't do anything to them. I just kind of left them at this color because I wanted to leave it at that color because everything else I sprayed down already. And then I put some pearls here to match with the cutouts. And then the back. That's it. Um, yeah. So that's my little uh, mini album. I don't know if it's really a mini album, but that's my little album that I did. Okay, thanks for watching guys. Bye.